relationship with that um, from the standpoint of a person knowing that you know, going this route gives me the opportunity of becoming what I expect of myself. Marion basketball coach Gus Gillespie has watched Jackson Connors' maturation from his sophomore year to his senior season. Player development will continue to be a focus at the next level. The part of Jackson that, that impressed me the most is just his maturity. Uh, I, I got to watch a, you know, what I call a boy grow into a man. Player development's big, and, you know, that's really big right now. So, uh, you know, just development my game is, you know, big, and, you know, I think they, uh, you know, are going to be the best help with that. He's got a lot of ability, a lot of upside, and I think the, the biggest thing that I liked about Jackson from that standpoint was the fact he was willing to go out every single day that I saw him and work extremely hard and, you know, more times than not, we do it with a smile on his face. Like he enjoys what he does. A sign of his character was evident down the stretch. Jackson eventually broke Greg Sterick's scoring record, but was always focused on his team. Very impressed with that. You know, you had the weight of the regional uh, at Marion. Uh, you had, you know, four or five games left and him have to get so many points. And, you know, we really never addressed that until maybe the last two weeks of the season. He handled it with class. He handled it with... Uh, just great composure, and, and, and again, uh, for an 18-year-old kid and, and, and on the stretch, uh, to handle it without maturity was very impressive. Jackson Connor and Greg Sterick will be connected again. Sterick is the athletic director at John A. Logan. He was extremely excited for Jackson when it got close and um, had followed Jackson's career, um, you know, as it, as it got closer to his senior year, knowing that'd be the possibility. But, I, you know, Greg had handled that so humbly as you would expect and was extremely excited when Jackson uh, made the decision to come to John A. Logan. And, you know, Greg's a Marion guy through and through. Jackson is ready to get to work and take his game to the next level. It was something that stood, you know, really stood out to me that impressed me was the fact of, of Jackson making a statement, you know, I, I, I want to be somewhere where I can get challenged and where I, you know, can get pushed. And I think that says a lot for a person, especially a kid of his age, when they embrace the challenge of that and they embrace the, the possibility of there being some struggle. Practicing against, you know, some of the, you know, top players, you know, that's obviously just going to push you uh, sitting down and guarding quicker guys every day. Guarding stronger guys, that's, you know, that's going to make you quicker. That's going to make your first step quicker. When guarding the ball, it's going to make you stronger. Uh, and then when you're doing that in practice every day, and then when you're able to come into a game, and, uh, you know, that it just makes it that much easier after practicing day in and day out. I think there's a lot of uh, potential, you know, in that, in that body, and I, I think he's only scratching the surface of where he could be. Jason Hurst, WSIL News 3 Sports. Thank you so much, Jason. Jackson Connors got big goals while he's at John A. Logan. He wants to win a national championship. That'll do it for sports. I'm Kendra Sheehan for WSIL News 3 Sports.